dead stop right in front of me. You can't tell, but it's probably an 8% grade already. Dead stop. Gear one, throttle only. Ready? Whoa, shit. Did you guys see how, like, watch this. It literally, like, pops up. Whoa, shit. See? And I'm not, like, embellishing that. It literally, in gear one, this thing literally pops up. You literally have to, oh, shit. You literally have to, like, lean forward. Jesus Christ. It's like jumping on a freaking horse. Jesus Christ. Oh, the gear came off, or the, what did I zip? The super chain came off. Shit. Come on, goddammit. All right, I'm literally I'm gonna do it in pedals and throttle, but it's like it, it thing fucking takes off on you. Oh shit, my seat like needs to be higher or something. Things are happening to people. I gotta tighten some stuff. All right. Okay. I literally have to turn the throttle off and pedal a little bit because it's literally gonna fly, fly out from under me. That's how powerful this damn thing is. So I'm gonna give it a quick little pedal in gear one, and then I'm gonna do the, the throttle. Okay. See, I can't do it. I literally have to, oh God. Are you guys seeing this? I literally can't do, I gotta start, oh God. I wanna start on the freaking hill. Throttle, okay, there it is. Jesus Christ. Throttle only, gear one. It has so much freaking torque, people, that it's like jumping on a horse. The thing, I had such a problem because it kept like popping out from under me. All right, gear one, throttle only. Tarantula Hill, it's like 300 feet, probably 18% grade. And uh, I'll tell you, I'm a Super 73R. I stopped like right about here. And I will say in just a second, you can't tell, but right in front of me, it's probably 20%. I don't know if this thing's gonna get up it in throttle only. I might have to start pedaling. Let's see. Oh my god, people. It's throwing a lot of freaking wattage. A lot of wattage. 1,066 watts. But it's taking me up this. Are you kidding? In throttle only. Are you guys seeing this? This is probably a 20% grade right now. Very hard to tell, but it is. Oh my God. This is absolutely insane. Never in a million years would I have expected a little bike like this to be able to do this. like burn the motor. I'm like trying to like conserve a little bit here, you know? I'm like letting up on the throttle a little bit because I don't want to like burn the motor out. I'm only giving it like 500 watts to there. But I'm on, I'm only using throttle, people. Literally. Throttle. Isn't that something? Like, does anybody understand like the significance of what I'm telling you right now? Throttle only. Little folding bike up Tarantula Hill. Like, I was in a Hemway Cruiser, and I had to freaking, okay, now I gotta do with this damn torque again. Okay, I was in a Hemway Cruiser, and, you know, I had to freaking pedal the whole way. And I think has got a beast of a hub motor, though. So, wow. And here we are, people. We're up in the clouds. There are the clouds. We're literally up in them. And we've taken a freaking, a mini elevator up here, you know? AKA the Luna Pullman. Hey there. Okay, we've now gone basically to the top of Tarantula Hill throttle only, people. Throttle. I'm only going really slow because I don't want to burn out the motor rates. It's showing that it's using a lot of wattage, you know? Which, of course. I'm trying not to, like, give it full throttle because I don't want it to, like, burn away, you know, burn the motor. 
Yes, yeah, so right now I'm only using 500 watts, which is good. And here we are. You can go up a little bit further, but it's all dirt. So I'll just say this is the top of Tarantula Hill. Like, wow, people. Holy bejesus. Wow. Unbelievable. This thing is my shit kicker. Damn. Look at it. Are you serious? Wow. 52 volt battery. 750 watt mid drive with a 1500 um, uh, peak. And it's a Bafang, which I just learned. I didn't realize it was a Bafang. Wow. Here we are, people. Infamous, worldwide, globally famous Tarantula Hill. I was up here once and I saw a Roadrunner, which was pretty exciting, but I do not see any Tarantula or Tarantula. I do not see any. So I don't know why they call it that. It's probably just for posterity's sake. But anyway, so there you have it, people. Tarantula Hill, throttle only. Gear one on a folding bike. Mid drive power, people. That's what it's all about. 52 volt batteries, no joke. Most folding bikes have a 36 volt, well not most, but a lot. This thing has a 52 volt. I mean like, I'd say 99, maybe even 99.5% of typical electric bikes. I'm not talking about like the cake and those huge ones. But typical electric bikes, 99.5% of them have 36 or 48 volt. To come across one with a 52 volt is very rare, you know? I think the uh, Juiced Hyper Scorpion 2 with the two batteries, I believe that may have 52 volt. I know that the Aerial Rider Grizzly has 52 volt. But you're talking about like expensive bikes, people, like over 2,000, you know? This thing's a folding bike, people. Folding bike, you know? Like, Jesus Christ. I don't know, I'm in awe. Constantly in awe of this little freaking thing. Just unbelievable. I kind of expected it just from what I read from people, but like, really? I mean, you read or you see videos and you're like, all right, that's bullshit. Something's going on there. But not really like popping a wheelie every time they hit the throttle. But it's true. Like, my God. Brakes are pretty good too, people. Gotta say, pretty freaking good. Oh shit, oh, I pulled that turn a little wide there and almost slipped. Gotta get me my dirt tires, people. Gotta start dirting it. Alright. Alright, that was Branch of the Hill, people. Check mark, done. On to the next thing. next for this thing I don't know but I'm excited for what's next because based on what we just did which was literally colossal I don't think you understand the significance um, like I don't know if there's any electric bikes for under probably 4,000 I mean probably the closest thing would be I can tell you that the Onyx can't do it I would say maybe the Suron but again it's not even really a bike I don't think it has pedals so Electric bike that can go up that throttle only. I, I question people, you know, unless you're talking about like, you know, a high-end mountain bike, um, like a specialized for seven or $8,000. Other than that, I could really question whether or not there's any electric bike that can go up that throttle only. Let me know what you can think. If you think of any, any people in the comments. <clears throat> but this is an $1,800 folding bike. Listen to that word, folding bike. Hence, not a big beefy bike, not a big strong bike. And it literally went up an 18% grade. Uh, Tarantula Hill throttle only. Like, that is insane. Now, I will say, <clears throat> when you use a lot of um, wattage, power, 
on these bikes, the battery meter that shows like the battery percentage, if you will, that goes all the way down into the red and starts like flashing, which means, doesn't mean your battery's dead, it just means you're using so much of your battery right now. It's kind of like red lighting a car. So that's why when it started to flash red, I like turned it down and I only used like a little bit of the throttle. So I wouldn't, <clears throat> like I, I, instead of pushing the throttle all the way in 100%, I used it, only pushed it in halfway. So it only used like 600 watts instead of 1100, 1200 watts, you know? So. <clears throat> anyway, I think that and the mountain gate road in LA that I went up, throttle only, I think that kind of taxed my battery a little bit. Because now we're at like, it hasn't really recovered yet. Let me see if I put it in no pedal assist if the battery recovers a little bit. It's showing a fourth right now. Okay, it's looking like it is recovering. It's not red anymore, it's blue now, which is good. Let's just see if I can. If you don't use the power of the bike, the battery sometimes like looks like it recovers, you know? It's not literally recovering, it's just, it's returning to its natural spot, which, because you're not using any power, it's like, okay, now we're not using any power, I'm gonna give you the actual reading, you know? So now it's at like a third, which is pretty cool. I gotta motor through this little thing here. So anyway, that was it, people. Hope you enjoyed. Like and subscribe. Getting close to 800. God bless, peace out.